This project is LoRa based wireless weather station monitoring system. Here we have two sections. This one is transmitter and this one is receiver. Here receiver like as a LoRa gateway. On transmitter side, hardware connection sir, Arduino and its daughter board along with power supply 16x4 LCD. Here LoRa model connected to Arduino SPA pins. Rain sensor and DHT level, humidity and temperature, LDR sensor and atmospheric pressure sensor connected to Arduino analog and digital pins respectively. Here receiver consists of ESP32 node MCU with LoRa and in this node MCU model has a inbuilt Wi-Fi. This can be communicated with IoT server. Now before going to start this project, we have to create hotspot in our mobile with the username IoT server and password IoT server123. Now we have to open hotspot settings. We can see here network name IoT server and password IoT server123. Save. Mobile should have internet through the SIM. Now power on the both sides. Here an LCD it is showing T for temperature, H for immunity, ATM means atmospheric pressure, rain sensor and LDR. Arduino reads the all sensors data and displaying on LCD. Here every 30 seconds data will be uploaded to the receiver and displaying on LCD like this. And also node MCU upload sensors data to IoT server. Now we have to open server URL project factory server.in. We can see here URL is process factory server.in and it is asking username and password. Here username is LoRa2 and password is LoRa2. Here on LCD, it is showing LDR status light. Now it is showing in dark. LS means LoRa send the data to receiver. We can see here LDR dark. If we are activate rain sensor, here it is showing on LCD rain fall. And third condition is DH11. And fourth one is atmospheric pressure. It is activating based on atmospheric pressure. Now we have to open the server.
Here data will be visible in table format and also graphical format. Now we have to refresh this page. We can see here temperature, humidity, atmospheric pressure, rain sensor status, LDR status with respect to date and time. Now we have to press the switch to graph view.